What is going on everybody? It's your boy John D. Saunders and I'm here with a new remix The Digital Block is Back Baby I'm super excited to provide you guys with some really high quality content As you can see I'm in the new digs The new home office is definitely coming along so today I want to talk about taking back your time and using this free tool to actually automate your calendar so you don't have to worry about anything. So to start, if you're like me, you probably go back and forth with clients or prospects when locking in the time to email or correspond with them, right? You're like, well, does one o'clock work on Tuesday? Does three o'clock work on Wednesday? No, you know, I have to pick up my kid. No, I have to do this. So it's a constant back and forth, right? Well, about a year and a half ago, I found a tool called Calendly. And what this tool does is it automates your entire calendar. You can block off times that you're not available so people can't book that time. And then it automates the process where all you do is send a link and it gets taken care of. So I'm gonna jump on my computer, show you guys how this works, and we'll go through the process together. Let's do this. Okay guys, so first thing you wanna do is actually go to Calendly dot com this is the platform where you can schedule meetings without the back and forth email also to add it is free for one type of event so in most cases especially for us we usually do meetings in 30 minute increments so we only need the free option and we use it on a daily basis so you can scroll through all the options to kind of find out a little bit more about it and then you're going to hit sign up now once you get in and i'll, I'll log into my account so you guys can get an idea Okay, so you can have different types of events. So once you're in here, you're gonna go to event types, right? And then you can create different types of events. Now, what you wanna do is add a new event type, and then you can kind of create, is it, is it going to be a one-on-one -on -one or a group setting? Let's do one-on-one. -on -one. So the event name, let's say we're going to do um, one hour consultation, right? And then we add a location. You can either put a link to your go to meeting, a link to Uber conference or whatever platform you use. Then in the description and instructions, you want to keep this pretty consistent across the board. So one hour consult consultation would just say, hey, glad you signed up. You can join the meeting here. Right. And for us, since we use Uber conference, which is another free tool, I'm all about the free, by the way. You can go in and I'm gonna just hit copy info. I'm gonna exit and then I'm just gonna put the link here. So now anytime someone signs up for an event and it's locked into their calendar, this automatically goes into the description instructions, right? So then you have your Calendly link and you just hit next. Now this is the super dope part. You can create the event duration here. So you can pick the general amount of how long it's going to take. Um, date range, you know, I usually have it infinitely and I usually have it infinitely and then you can do event time zone And now you're going to set up your availability. This is probably the best part of it, right? So for me, you know, I usually work from about 8 a.m. To about 3 I take a break and then I might work at that night from like 10 to 12 But I usually only take calls between around 9 and 12 on specific days because I like to block out time to really grind Right, so let's do Monday my availability will be 9 a.m. to let's say 11 a.m., right? And let's just do this one day just so you could see. And then I'm gonna do apply to all Mondays. So now on Mondays, you can only book me for that time. So what I would do if I were you is go through each day and kind of set yourself up so you're not always available, but you're available in certain increments so that you can allocate time towards other things. So once you set that up, you're going to hit next once more. Um, all my information's in here. You can actually do additional options, right? You can have invitee questions where you can ask specific questions before they get on the call. You can do notifications where they get text notifications, email reminders. Um, some of these features are in the paid version. And then you can also add custom links and collect payments. But for right now, we're gonna keep it super simple. And um, now I'm gonna view the live event page. Whoops, let me make it live first. So let's do save and close. Let's go back to my event types. And then I'm actually gonna turn this off momentarily and we're gonna turn on one hour consultation. And now what you do is you keep this link, right? This link right here. And this is the link that you share with anyone that you wanna correspond with. 
So for example, if I send this link to a prospect, they'll go, they'll see this calendar, right? They might hit, okay, I want to talk to him on Monday. As you can see, it's 9.30 a.m. That's the only time I'm available. Now, the reason why is because you can actually sync this with your Google Calendar. So because I had blocked out 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. on Mondays, there's a conflict in my Google Calendar that makes it so that I'm only available at 9.30. And so to do that, you actually go to the Calendly app, you go to Calendar Connection, and then you can actually add in the specific calendars that you want to tie in to Calendly. And that's what makes this platform so amazing. And again, I'm not getting paid for this. This is just a tool I use on a daily basis that I love. So um, you actually sync it with your calendar. So it's synced with my Google Calendar. Um, I have different calendars on my list. I only have five form personal highlighted. And then I can actually choose which calendar the Calendly events go into. So again, this tool is just phenomenal and super easy to use extremely user friendly. Um, that's it. Thank you guys for watching the digital block. I'm super excited to be back. Took an eight month hiatus, but I'm back to provide you guys with quality content. I'm going to be doing this on a bi weekly basis. So make sure you subscribe and let's do this thing. Peace.